Now that we've met Ray, who really is living with dementia and doing some great things and struggling with some others, what I thought we'd look at is another part of the house that people recognize as having dangers and risks, but sometimes when we get to the place in the disease that Ray's at, it's easy to miss some of the things that turn risky because we don't think that way. We don't see that way. We don't understand that way. We don't taste, we don't smell that way. We don't even use our hands or our bodies that way. So if I don't think about it and don't imagine it from the point of view of the person who's doing what they're doing with what they've got, I can get pretty frustrated. Or in this case, I'm going to be the person living with dementia and Lynn's going to be my helper, but she's going to be an unskilled person. I mean, it's not that she's not trying. She is trying to keep me safe. She's trying to get me engaged, but without skill and without knowledge, kitchens and bathrooms can become really scary places for the person who's trying to provide support. I'm not actually all that worried about it. Oh no, not that. No, no, okay. I got it. No, I got it. I got it. I'm going to make a thing. Tifa, no. It. Let me, let me, let me, let All me, right. let me, let me do it, do it. All right, go ahead, do it. I know, I know how to do I've done this. You take it. Okay, that's enough. Just one. Okay. Just one. No, that's not where it goes. Ow. Ow. Get your, no. get Tifa. Let, I'm no, gonna, no, it's Tifa. the kind you No, put. no, no, it goes here. Here, that's music. La, 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 music. That over there. Oh my God! Get that. Just write it right in here. Put it in well, here. I'll put it, put in it down here. in the hole. Put it down in there. No, no, you got. Keep. You got to put the bread in first. I got the it. bread in first. Mm -hmm. Put the bread in. Yeah. Keep. Put the bread in. Yeah. Put it in. Well, it here, I'll it just do it. Let me just do it. I've got no, it. you got it. I no, can get no, this. you're gonna hurt yourself. Stop it. Get you're gonna hurt yourself. Go on. So let's start over here. Let's okay. start at this counter. So we had the bread. You had the bread over here. You had a music player over here because I love music and uh -huh. frequently I will dance with you. But then we had the toaster over here. So my brain did what? Do you think with these pieces of data? Well, you saw the bread and mm -hmm. you wanted to put it in the toaster or yeah. you wanted to do something with the bread. I wanted to do bread. something with the bread. Unfortunately, there were two possibilities. Mm -hmm. And which one was more in front of me in the moment? That one. Yeah. And it was easier because it that was, popped up. And, yeah. And so I'm maybe thinking something like a panini sandwich or a press, a sandwich press. And so then with this one, that one didn't make as much sense to me. Yeah. Was, so even though historically a toaster should equal making toast with bread, for me, I had more trouble. So what did I do there? I had the the bread in one hand. And, yeah, and then you put your hand in the other, which is, <laughs> if you put it on, I mean, you could get, a, you know, so you could get hurt. If, if you are going to have a toaster out, mm -hmm. should it be plugged in? No. Ah, because what does that buy you then? some time. Yeah. And even if I put my hand in it, can I, in fact, no, you won't, you couldn't get hurt. So now you've reduced the danger mm -hmm. and you know, it's less dangerous. You know, it's not plugged in. Right. And even if I go to plug it in, it's going to take me a little bit of time to figure that out. Yeah. That's a little more difficult. So part of our problem was also having two of these things so close to each other. Mm -hmm. Do we need the music device anywhere really right around in here? No. Is it convenient for you? It is. Yeah. Well, that's great. But then it becomes inconvenient when I start doing things that you view as now. Right. Was that truly dangerous or annoying or risky? It was more annoying. Yeah. Yeah. But what happens is one dangerous thing after another, and then suddenly even the simple annoying things feel like they're, your voice wasn't better when you. No. And it seems more dangerous in this environment. Right. So even though it's convenient, mm -hmm. is it necessary for it to be there? No. So could it be in a place or a space where you can access it, mm -hmm. but I can't? 